And welcome back, Backyard Baseball fans, to another exciting edition of Backyard Baseball. Today we have the Rangers taking on the Melonheads. The Rangers are 5-2 and two on the season and the Melonheads are 4-3 and three, coming off of a heartbreaker loss in extra innings. As Pedro continues to try to find his stroke on the pitching now, he has not had a really great start this season. And he gets Pablo Sanchez to lead off against him this game. And if he can get that curveball to keep working all day, that's a nasty pitch. Strike two to Pablo. Goes for the high heat. Pablo gets, a, gets wood on it, but he is thrown out at first for the first out of the game. Good start from Pedro. Curveball looks really good. It's his screwball. There it is. It's his screwball that has given up the most home runs this season. But even that's still pretty a pretty good pitch. Bunt! And she's going to get there easily. What a perfect bunt. Oh, smacked. Ichiro can't get it. Safe at second. An unusual error from Ichiro in center field. Although we'll have to see the footage again to see if he actually committed an error or if he just missed it. Strike two. Pedro gets him swinging. Strike three for the second out of the inning. Yeah, the first inning has not done well for Pedro. Can he get out in a clean first inning? And Tony Delvecchio with a amazing diving catch today to end the first inning. And the Melonheads avoid giving up a run. It was it does go down as an error for each row in center field. An unusual error. And the Melonheads give up their one, two, three. Ichiro, Dante, and Sosa. And I mean, you almost for sure think that Ichiro's going to be bunting here. Because if it ain't broke, don't fix it. He misses the first pitch. Gets the second one put in play. Foul, though. Oh. And Ichiro launches that one, but it's foul again. Ichiro launches another one. Also foul. He's putting up a great at bat so far. One, two. And he misses the fastball for strike three. Dante Robinson's up next. He's looking to bunt as well, but it's right to the third baseman. But he's going to beat it out. Dante aboard. Up to the plate, Sammy Sosa Sammy is up next. There goes Dante. Dante with a stolen base. He's now on second for Sosa. Fly ball, center field. Pablo makes the catch. Dante's going to try to tag up on him, though. Dante's there. Sosa just didn't quite have enough on it. Two outs, we're on third for Jim Tomei. Launches it to right field right at him. And that will end the first inning at 0-0. Zero to zero. All right, Pedro settling in here in the second inning as his screwball can't quite seem to locate at the bottom corner there for a second, but he got it. Is that something wrong with the controller? Strike two. You gotta protect the plate when you're in the hole. Two strikes. Oh, that ball is launched. This will be a double, maybe a triple. Pedro can't seem to get it. 
And that is a double. Not the start of the inning Pedro wanted. Back up the middle, Pedro makes the catch. Pedro having a hard time finding the zone again. Rio. Check the runner. Ball four. Pedro walks the next runner after giving up the leadoff double. Not a great way to start the inning. And they're trying to steal. And Gomo throws him out at third. Can you believe it? Como <laughs> tries to throw him out at third again, not this time. And they bun aboard for a single to get Pablo. To get Pablo Sanchez up. Not the guy Pedro wanted to see, and he's going to get through for an RBI single. Tony just didn't quite have the range on him to get that ball. Pedro is struggling to find the zone here in the second inning. Another 3 0 count. Oh, there's already two outs. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> the Rangers score one in the top of the second. We head to the bottom of the second. It is one to nothing. Ahmed Khan, Mike Piazza, and Tony Delvecchio leading off. These three guys have all been struggling recently. We thought Ahmed had his big breakout game against Oakland, but has not been able to do much. Ahmed with a fly ball to center field. Pablo gets it. And have a hard time doing anything in center field. Piazzo with a fly ball to left field caught for the second out. They're putting the ball in play. Davecchio takes ball one. Putting the ball in play, just not having much luck with it. That was a very weird hit, and that will end the inning on Delvecchio's jam, jam sandwich. After two, it is one to nothing. Strike one finds the corner, and that's a beautiful shot right between the third and shortstop for another hit. Got him! Picked him off at first. Oh, and that well that makes the pickoff worth a little bit more. Because now instead of that being a two-run shot, it's just a solo shot. And Pedro just continues to get sh to get banged by the long ball. Dante is going to throw him out from right field. What a play by Dante. Pedro having having a tough time today just putting him in. Strike two. Ball. Oh, are you kidding me? Strike three. 
That ends the inning. We move to the bottom of the third with our score. Zemelinen. Rangers score another one. It's two to nothing. Gomo, Pedro, and Ichiro up here for the third inning. Gomo and Pedro struggling bats. Gomo hasn't really done a whole lot since since the second game of the season where he had his where he had his home run. Line ball right up the middle for the first out of the inning. Hit it well. Another ball right back up to the pitcher. Up next is Ichiro. Tries to bunt it, but it's foul. Ichiro having a tough time getting that bunt put into fair territory. Right back up the middle, and Ichiro is going to be thrown out. And the Melon has just got nothing working for him offensively right now. And Pedro's gone through three innings, two earned, and six hits. Gotta wonder how much longer he'll be in. Ball one. Ball two. There is the put out. They don't call this kid hey bada bada for nothing. Ball one. And the count goes to one and oh. Pedro can't feel it cleanly, but he still gets to it in time to throw him out. Pedro's got two quick outs. You'd love to see him get a quick third out here. Strike two. Strike three. Got him. And Pedro does what he needs to and gets a quick three outs. Into the bottom of the fourth. It is two to nothing. Dante Sosa Tome. Here's where they expect to see something happen for the ballot heads. Dante throws the cheeseburger into his mouth, and he's ready to go. Bunt back up the middle. The pitcher's quick. Dante is out. Sammy Sosa is up next. Sosa with a shot to center. center. Gone just over the fence. He just got enough of it. He just got enough of it. Just over the fence. For the Melonheads' first run of the game. It is 2-1 to one now. Jim Tomei up next. See if he can try to go back-to-back -back here. Ball two. Pitcher struggling to find the zone now, but he swings at that one. It's two and one. Ball three. You know Tome wants to hit. And Tome shows why he wants to hit. But it's dropped by the right fielder. And the Melonheads get a break. Ahmed Khan up next. That's going to be a base hit. They use the sonic boom well to get the base hit. For Mike Piazza. One out. We're on first and second. Piazza shot to center field right at Pablo. Who makes the catch. And so Tony Del Vecchio trying to make something happen out of this inning. Shot up the middle. It's a base hit. And they're going to hold Tomei at third. Which loads the bases up for Gomo Arigato. Does he have a heroic moment in him? 
Swings right through the changeup. That was a great pitch. Another changeup. He's not going to miss two in a row, but it's a fly out to the shortstop. And after all that, they get one. We head to the fifth. It is two to one. Nice to see the Melonheads hitting again. They only got one run out of that. And they're not going to see Pedro face Pablo for a third time. And they're going to bring in Sosa. It's nice to see a new face on the mound, Sonny. Strike one. Sosa turning out to be their biggest high leverage arm on this roster. Dante gonna th try to throw him out where I feel he gets him. Pablo Sanchez was just thrown out from right field. It's only because the ball was smoked right at him. Oh, and that's gonna get through the infield for a base hit. Strike one. That's a fly ball to left field. Tony is there. He makes the catch. Stepping up to the plate, Beverly Suggs. Strike one, right at the knees. Might have gotten a friendly call from the umpire. I don't even remotely understand how you hit that. Oh, it's off the fence. That ball was at their head. Ground ball to shortstop. Pedro over to second. Gets the out, and that will end the inning with no run scored. And here's their biggest shot to do something. It's the 9-1-2. Pedro, Ichiro, Dante. They just need one to tie, two to take the lead. Try to give Sosa a chance to pull this one out. Pedro leading off the inning. He's going to try to bunt up the middle, but he just does not have the speed to make it work. The 0 for 2 Ichiro is trying to get his first on base the first time today. Misses his first bunt off a changeup. Ichiro is Ichiro's having a tough day. He just can't see the ball all that well. There's a good bunt. He's going to beat it out. Ichiro's on first. That's all he needed. He got on base the first time today. They've been needed that. They try to pick off Ichiro to no luck. They try again. Still with no luck. And Ichiro is going to be there easily on the changeup. This catcher's got a pretty solid arm. Dante with a bunt. And it's going to work. It's now first and third. With only one out in the inning for Sammy Sosa. And Sosa pops it straight up to center field. But Dante's going get to get to second on the throw home. So Jim Tome up next. First and second, two outs. Tomei fouls it backwards right behind him. Tomei grounds that one. Strike two. He swings at the changeup. Fly ball right field. And that will end the inning. We move to the final frame with our score. The Melonheads won. And that might have been the Melonheads' biggest chance to win this game. But it is 2-1 to one, heading into the top of the sixth. Sosa still on the mound. He's got no earned runs this season. Strike two. Got him swinging. Strike three. And that ends the in ends the inning. That's the first out of the inning. Jeez. Wishful thinking. 
Oh, what a play by Ahmed. Can he get the out? He gets the out. What a play. Defense shows up shows up for Sosa here in the sixth. The pitcher looks in. Ball in the dirt. Good take. And Piazza makes the catch. Almost almost slammed into his shortstop. So they're gonna have to try to scrape something together. They got Ahmed Piazza and Del Vecchio. Three struggling hitters. What do they have in store for them in the bottom of the six down one? Strike one. It's clearly a new pitcher for the Rangers. Strike two. <laughs> With a blast right back up to the pitcher. Mike Piazza's up next. Piazza shot caught by the left fielder. Tony Del Vecchio up next. Bunt foul. Bunt, this one's fair. But Del Vecchio's gonna get thrown out and that's gonna end the ball game. And the Mountain Heads go down two to one. Ichiro gets his tenth stolen base of the season, and that's really all they have to celebrate. What a what a rough game, tough game. Bats have gone cold the past two games after their huge 15-run win against the Oakland Athletics. And they're now four and four on the season. They still cling on to a tie of the lead with the Rockies at four and four. Their whole division struggling this season. Orioles lose their first game as they go to 7-1. and one. Rangers are still second in their division after they go up to 6-2. to two. That's the division to look out for, the AL West. That's the division to look out for, 7-1 and 6-2. And and do we play the Angels this season? We do, on the road against the Angels. We get a chance to two division rivals at the end of the season, so there's still plenty of baseball left. I think they're gonna might might look to change the batting order a little bit. They're gonna move Tony Del Vecchio up to fifth. They're gonna leave Pedro at ninth. Piazza's gonna go down to eighth now. Domo is going to slide up, and that's going to be it for them. That's their new lineup. They're going to adjust to get Pedro back on the mound for this next game. And as always, thank you for another edition of Backyard Baseball. We'll see you later, you melon heads.